Big Twilight. We're going to a new dog park today. You're going to meet new doggies. Yeah, do you want to play with them? Twilight, do you want to play with the puppies? I hear you whining. You're getting excited. So today, Twilight and I are at a new dog park. This is called Stark's Dog Park in Schmokin' Dam, Pennsylvania. It's not too bad. A little small. Right now, we're the only puppies here. There is a couple leaving the park as we come in. But this was kind of like a spur of the moment thing. That we'd check out this park. So I got Twilight's ball ball here. You want your ball ball? You want it? I'm going to throw it. She got here she comes. That's a good girl. So we'll do a little review of the dog park here. Stark's Dog Park in Schmokin' Dam, Pennsylvania. It's got some benches, which are always nice. The gates are fine. This side of the dog park is for large breeds. If you notice here, this is a path we come down. Over here is another fenced-in section. That's for smaller breed dogs. That is always a good thing. Because Twilight, when she gets running full bore after her ball ball, cannot stop her 110-pound frame on a dime and has, on occasion, toppled over a little puppy that wants to play. No fault of her own, but it is nice that they have a dedicated area just to save that type of thing from happening. And of course, Twilight decides to take a poop poop, which I gotta go clean. So I'll check you guys in a minute. So one thing that can be improved here is the receptacle for the poop bags is all the way on the outside of the area so you got to walk all the way out here but they do have complimentary bags which is nice and here are the rules for the park and here are the rules for the doggos which is a nice touch so I just got done throwing Twilight's poop bag away go back down here she likes the area I like how they leave the grass a little tall I do like that. And of course the leaves give a nice touch this time of year. It is a pretty place. Twilight's got her ball ball. Come here. You gotta let me get it. I gotta throw it. She's gonna be a brat right now. Check out a new place. The thing I do like about this park is this little crick rolling here. Now again, this is outside the fenced area, so your pup pup can't be off leash. But in the summer when it's really hot, you can leave your pup pup on leash and let them enjoy the crick. Ready for another one? Good girl. Yeah, it's a good girl. Such a good girl, Pop. Can I have a ball ball? Can I have it? Hey, 
Oh. Give it to me, so I didn't throw it. Come here. Pop. Come here. Give me the ball. Hey. Hey. Pop. Give it. Good girl. Oh, there it is. Ready? You want it? Huh? So that's one thing I did notice while I had Twilight running around here. She's getting panty and a little bit thirsty. Lucky I have water in the car for her because there are no water dishes here. Or there's no fountain, spigot, or normal dog park in Bloomsburg, Pennsylvania. Has a water spigot there for the doggos. They can get drinks. Maybe I'll do a review of that dog park next time. But yeah, this is a review of the Stark Dog Park in Shemokin Dam, Pennsylvania. Twilight likes it. Other than the lack of water supply, it is a very nice park, if a little small. Uh, thank you for watching from Twilight and Blaze. So yeah, that was a Stark Dog Park here in Shemokin Dam, Pennsylvania. On the outside, there is a little children's play area, along looks like with some bathroom, bathroom facilities. Um, but yeah, due to the lack of water for the pups, I don't know if we'll be back, but it was a nice little park. So hello everyone. Yes, we were just at the Stark, Stark Dog Park in Smokin Dam, Pennsylvania. We were here from about 4.30 to 6 on a Monday afternoon. There were two dogs leaving when we got here um, and no dogs at the park. So she didn't get to at interact with any other dogs. She did enjoy the space. She liked playing in the leaves. She liked the taller grass that was left there. But they didn't mow too short. The, it's a very beautiful area. There's some shady spots, so in the summer I think it'll be really nice. There's a creek out back that you can take your dogs into while on leash. It doesn't run through the dog park itself, so they can't be off leash to there. But on leash, they, they would have a good time. That being said, the lack of like a water spigot or water supply for the pups is a bit concerning. Um, like there's nothing inside unless you bring your own water we may be back i'll give it another shot um maybe on the weekend there might be more puppies here but we'll see thank you everyone